I think we hear, you know, oh, the market's horrible, the market's horrible, but I feel like I've been hearing that the last five years, and I thought it was going to be super easy, and that was definitely not the case. Rising rent prices and a lack of affordable housing means some Central Texans are left with literally no options. Yeah, tonight 25 News reporter Andrew Lomparski is taking a closer look at a problem that just is not going away. Homelessness looks different to everyone experiencing it. Now I'm uh, staying with a friend, thankfully, but it, had I not had that opportunity to stay with a friend, I would be literal homeless, like living in a car. Natalie McClure is a mother with a good job, community connections, and even works with a community organization to help people avoid becoming homeless. She put in more than 30 housing applications in the last three months alone. Half my uh, money that would go towards rent went to application fees alone. She's desperately looking for an affordable place for her and her daughter to live. Affordability plus a Section 8 housing voucher making her search nearly impossible. They don't think it's the quality of tenant that they are looking for, so they pass them over. The search for affordable housing in Central Texas has only gotten harder over the last year. The average cost to rent a one-bedroom apartment in Waco has jumped more than 50% from 2021. People who were making livable wages even just a year ago, they aren't livable anymore. The Waco Salvation Army says it's rapid rehousing program to provide emergency assistance to those facing homelessness is struggling to place clients. The choices that you have right now are not going to be what you had two years ago. And you're going to have to come to the decision about homelessness, staying in shelter, sleeping in your car, or moving to another city. Economic experts say there aren't any signs of the problem reversing anytime soon, but it may be plateauing. McClure says cities like Waco are in severe need of more affordable housing and fast. If we're comfortable as a, a community um, allowing a child to sleep in a car, then something needs to be done about that. She's hopeful projects like the city's plan to end homelessness Bring relief soon.